everybody. I am Letty Trinidad, Service Deli Bakery Merchandiser, and today I'm here with Nava Salgado. Good morning from our customer communications department. And as you know, Nalva, February 2nd is the big game. And today, we are here because Nalva will be teaching us how to make a perfect guacamole. Should we start? Let's do it. Do you have a secret for me not crying while I cut the onion? If you're a cry baby, you're always gonna cry. So then that's it, I'm always <laughs> gonna cry. <laughs> this is a big onion. I'm just gonna use like a quarter of it. A quarter of it? Yeah, great. I like to dice it uh, very small, not very fine. Yeah. Uh, now I'm going to cut the tomatoes. Mm. Well, this is Roma tomato, and these are my favorite. Those are your favorite. The uh, other regular tomatoes, I just like them for my salad. So now you're going to cut the serranos. Yes. You prefer serranos from jalapenos? I do. Nothing against jalapenos, but serranos are my uh, favorite. I usually use three to four. And what about habaneros? That's even better. If you guys are really willing to play in the big game, then you will put habaneros in your guacamole. I'm gonna cut some lemons, Ooh. the green lines. Just gonna use three of them. We don't want it too sour either. So now you're gonna cut the avocado. And Alba, I know a lot of people are afraid of cutting an avocado because some people really get hurt. Do you have a trick? No, but this is how I do it. Well, and I know you're an expert because you're always in the kitchen. They're beautiful, though. So with the spoon, uh, you're going to scoop out the avocado. That This is a real nice avocado, or what we say is an aguacate. Once we have all the avocado in the molcajete, we're going to smash the avocado. I'm going to add a little bit of black pepper. Just a little bit to taste? Just a little bit. Okay, just don't make me sneeze now, Nava, please. First, you don't want to cry. Now you don't want to sneeze? No, I'm... That's what I call Chiyona. <laughs> okay. Or cry baby. Then we continue there. smashing all the avocados. It's a pretty fast recipe, actually. It is very, very fast. We're going to add the ingredients. What about if I just get in the game? Because you know, we can also do a nice mask. You know what? I like the idea. It's right? very healthy for your skin. Well, hey, I say now I'm in the game. Okay, now... Ooh. Oh, sorry. So we're gonna squeeze some lemon juice in. And then on top of that, you can add a little bit of salt. And you smash again. Not too much, Not so too it can much. still be. Just to mix it up. So now that this is it, that's what it. What took us, five minutes? Yeah, I told get you, this it's together. very simple. For five minutes, and we're pairing them up with some beautiful Kroger chips. But you know what, Nalva? If people are like me, I will just go to Service Deli Bakery and buy some guacamole. Good it tastes idea. homemade. And then you kind of put it in your own molcajete. My in-laws will know because it's a pretty good taste. But what <laughs> else can we pair? I mean, when you think about food for less food school, we have platters, we have cakes, we have beer, we have chips. We have everything you need for the big game. But you know what we're missing? Something else to drink. I agree. I wish. My favorite tequila is Patron, oh, look at that. I mean, nothing better than a shot of this with some perfect guacamole. Who was that? Sandra Gallegos from our adult beverage department. Salud. Salud. Con guacamole. Oh my God, Alba, this is muy picante. This is hot. You added a lot of serranos in there. That's how I like it. Oh, uh, okay. And I told you I was a little crybaby. You're a crybaby all the time. <laughs> I know. How You're a chillona. Uh, well, thanks for joining us today. I hope you guys enjoy how to make this beautiful guacamole recipe. Just remember, you can get all these ingredients, the beer, the tequila, the parties, everything for your big game at Food for Let's Food School. Carne asada too. Nalva, thank you so much. As always, my pleasure, Liddy, and I hope uh, everyone enjoys this uh, delicious uh, guacamole. And I say, you guys need to try it at home. But I say we should have a shot of tequila. I say we should. <laughs>